Concept in people's mind that uh, you got to come into church and have a title or a position uh, and all this kind of stuff, right? And to get closer to God. But really, to get closer to God, amen, you got to start, amen, living your life and your actions got to be like God. Yes, amen. It's a true indicator that you are closer to God. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Give some nods and hands amen. Because a lot of times now we have seen. People who in great positions with great titles and great big churches, amen, uh, their actions and conduct in life as a good indicator, they were never close to God. Amen. They had great talent, amen. but they weren't close to God. Uh -huh. Amen. 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 Say amen. amen. And so pray God. So here at Pure Gospel, and to those who listen and watch us uh, by, uh, by the means of uh, YouTube at Pure Gospel Community Church TV, amen, we'll take this series, amen, on called closer, and we're gonna start off by telling you, Amen, to be pa being patient like God make you closer to God. Amen. Uh, okay. Amen. All right. amen. Because you know, like I know, sometimes people in the church, yes. Amen. They have no patience. Say that. Amen. They will tell you already in church. Oh well. Yeah. All right. Amen. Sit in their seat. Amen. Come to church and you sit in somebody's seat. Somebody say amen. amen. Some folks lose, uh, they, they lose it when they walk into churches. But matter of fact, they can't even enjoy themselves because now they fight for it because you're in their seat. Yes. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Have you ever been in the church and they told you to move? Oh, that's so and so sad. <laughs> amen. That was a terrible feeling. You'd be like, God have mercy. They got reserved seats. Yes. Y'all put a sign on it then. <laughs> All right, but praise God, amen. Uh, being patient like God. And our key note to praise God for today's lesson is uh, Romans uh, 15, 5 through 7 says, May God give this patient. Now, notice it, right? It says, May God give this patient. Who give this patient? God. Uh, may God give this patient. Uh -huh. Help you live in complete harmony uh -huh. with each other. Yes. And here, praise God, what I said this earlier today about being a family. When you are a family, you can live at harmony. Yes, amen. Can I say amen? amen? With each other. Accepting each other just as Christ has accepted you. Amen. And amen. That's, the, that's the hard part about being close to God, is can you accept others as God accepted you? Uh -huh. and, and, and many of us pray God that song that says, just as I am, I come to thee. Yes. For a lot of us, amen, we ought to thank God with both hands, toes, whatever we can will, and thank God that we can come and God accepted us just as I was. Amen. And, then, and the truth be told, uh, Sister Curry, if I had to get myself together, I still would not be close to God. Amen. I still would not be in church. If I had to get myself together, yes. if I had to tell God, Lord, let me work some things out, Amen. I still be working some things out. Yes, amen. I would. Amen? amen. But God accepted us, amen, as Christ accepted us, amen. We got to learn to accept people just like Christ amen. accepted us. Amen. Now, I know it's hard mm -hmm. because your flesh mm -hmm. don't play that. Amen. The amen. world don't tell you that. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. All your life coming up, amen, you didn't see that. But in order to be close to God, you got to accept people just as Christ accepted you. Yes, amen. Amen? amen. Now, uh, first thing is, amen, God cares about you. And, number two, he cares about how you care for others. Amen. God cares about you. Uh -huh. And he cares about how you care for others. For others. Yes. Now, 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 some people who want to know the heart of God, amen, God, the heart of God, amen, is this. God is looking how you care for others. Uh -huh. He's not looking about what you got on. Okay, now. So I say amen. amen. God, see, see, this has been a deception of the church that got a lot of people frustrated with the church because the people are more concerned about what you wear to church. Uh -huh. Amen. 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 
They more concerned about what you wear and what you how you and as a matter of fact they say, How dare you come to God's house like that? Amen. 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 But, but God said God, God cares about you and he cares about how you care for others. Mm -hmm. It's an indicator, amen, for the God, whether or not uh, where you fellowship, amen, whether or not, amen, they have a patient of God or they demonstrate the patient of God towards you. Exactly. And when somebody looks at you cross out and funny, that don't make you feel good, do it? Amen. Somebody say amen. 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 That make you think that, do I have something on me? Or am I smelling or something? Let me check my arms and let me... <laughs> I see some of y'all laughing. Amen. But when people look at you like they don't care or that they got an attitude towards you, it makes you think it's me. Or it's Amen. Lord Jesus. Amen. Do I have something in my teeth or what? Amen. <laughs> you know? But God is God cares about you and he cares about how you care for others. Yeah. Uh, one of the ways you grow close to God is to realize how patient he is with you. Let's read it together. One, two, three. One of the ways you grow close to God is to realize how patient He is with you. Amen. And the whole series we're talking about here today, our brother, is being close to the God. And you gotta understand that one of the ways you grow close to God is to realize how patient He is with you. Do I have any witness in this Amen. house? Amen. 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 I, I know God is working in my wife because how patient she is with me. Amen. Amen. Somebody said, well, you are apostle. You ought to be all that. You ought to be. You ought to be. Amen. But I know God is working through my wife because she's showing her patience with me. Amen. I'm, some, I'm somebody else. I'm something. I know I'm something. I know I'm Somebody say amen. Amen. I know I'm hard to deal with at times. Somebody say amen. Amen. So I know about it. And then this is the part. I love my wife. I, I, I will tell you all this. Sometimes uh, she makes me mad. She'll get mad at me. <laughs> I get mad sometimes because she she because she got mad today, but tomorrow, hey baby, hey, I love the morning you get. I'm still mad at my why you ain't mad. <laughs> so I say amen. amen. I don't know, don't you know like it's over now, like she can reboot the next morning. <laughs> Somebody say amen. amen. But I thank God for that quality because uh, we would never be alone. We would never be where we are if we would, like, like if she was like me, we would, we would go months mad at each other. Amen. Somebody say amen. Amen. Somebody say you don't go months. Oh. Nah. Amen. Uh, <laughs> one of the ways you grow close to, to others is to be patient with them. Yes. Let's read it together. One of the ways you grow close to others is to be patient with them. I'm going to say yes. yes so I say amen. amen. Some folk, amen, uh, we say this all, often, they will work your, your nerves. nerves. Amen. Yes, they and they will get on your nerves when you're tired, yes. when things have gone wrong, yes. you having a bad yes. day, amen. people are cutting up on the job, yes. the school is calling you, yes. the collector don't call you all day, yes. they're calling the job. You got you got stuff coming up. You don't have the money. You don't know amen. how you're going to get it. So I say amen. amen. And praise God, amen. And one of the and, and, and then and that's when praise God. You know you grow close to God. You know God is working in your life. But you can go through all of that and still be patient with that person to get on the Amen. Amen. Being patient with things uh, not working out in your life. Amen. You know God is working on you. You know you're about to get there. You know you know you will come a long way. Because some of us say amen real quickly. Child, you just don't know. <laughs> amen. That was a time. Yes. I'm going to say amen. Amen. You know you can talk to God, pray to God, when you don't do what you used to do to people. Yes. Amen. Whoa. Amen. amen. You, might, you, you, you know you're not there yet. But you know, praise God, oh Lord Jesus. Some of you know right now, if you'd have caught me a week ago. <laughs> but thank God that we're getting closer to God, isn't it? Amen. You can see it, amen. You can feel it and you know it in your heart. Woo, some of you gotta go, whoo. Yes, amen. Thank yes, you. amen. Alright, now, God, the first thing you need to know is this. Our God is patient. 
come to be close to God, amen, to understand God, you've got to understand our God is patient. Yes. Number one, you got to be in your heart be close to God. Our God is patient. And God wants us to be like Him. So you got to understand from the jump street, our God is patient. It doesn't say amen, your apostle, your pastor, your woman of God, your, your whore. But see, we, we now in the church got to be so careful because we'll start worshiping and idolizing our leaders. Amen. Amen, apostle. Amen. 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 Well, I told you all, I my pastor tell you all. <laughs> 